Now let's take a look at somebody on the defensive side of the ball, D'Angelo Jennings. Coach, one of the 22 seniors honored last Saturday, a uh, high energy guy. Well, what I'd say about D'Angelo is this. He is probably one of the most loyal, most consistent person that does things for the team. He is the best team player that I could say maybe within this class because maybe he hasn't been the starter, but the way he shows up for practice every day and the way he wants to win and help the team in any way, that makes him a great team player. All right, number 56 always leaves 100% out on the field. Here's D'Angelo Jennings. Senior linebacker D'Angelo Jennings has racked up 40 tackles, two and a half for a loss, and forced a fumble heading into the playoffs. He brings a high level of intensity to the Panther defense. He's always been fast. You know, there's some things we're trying to, to get him to do a little bit better than he's done in the past. Um, but D'Angelo brings great energy to our, to our team, to our, especially in our room, the linebacker room. Um, he's a high energy guy. Um, he's a rah-rah guy to a certain degree, and, uh, and D'Angelo's a lot of fun to be around. If you have one little spark that, one little spark that just does anything, it, it can set off an entire forest fire, you know? So if there's one guy out there yelling, it's gonna be contagious. Contagious is enough to start the whole team, the whole sideline, the whole crowd, and then you got the whole game won just based off someone's energy. D'Angelo's attention to detail and working to constantly improve has helped him with his breakout senior season. Last summer I had one mission to get my eyes right. I got better at that. Um, this summer I, I, wanted, I wanted to uh, get better with my hips. So I, I helped, I did a lot of agility work this summer. You gotta focus little on little things so the, so the big thing will work out. The movement and exercise science major gives the UNI coaches options as he can excel at multiple positions on the field. He has showed us uh, a few times that we put him down defensive end and he's got the ability to force his will and make plays at defensive end. So that might be a wild card there too. So, you know, whether it's special teams, inside linebacker or defensive end, he brings a lot of um, experience and, you know, just the ability to get the job done. The football team will host the first round playoff game against Eastern Illinois at 4 p.m. on Saturday inside the Unidome. When we come back, we get Coach Farley's thoughts on the matchup and we look at the thrilling victory over number one, North Carolina. <laughs> 